Hey, Jerry. Uh, can you hear me? Yes, I can, can actually. Can you do me a favor? I was supposed to do the maintenance of one of our old Medusa's skate pod, but I'm stuck in the engine room fixing our damn reactor. Could you leave your cleaning trolley for a minute and uh, help me out? Just get inside the pod. You can't miss it. You're right next to it. Okay, sure. No problem. Hey, think like, hello. I'll do more play this today too. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm gonna... Yeah, crank it up. Whoa, you can go like... Oh, whoa. Interesting. You can go like mega. Like, that's interesting. It doesn't actually do like... Huh. It's not really fishbowl -y. It's like... Huh. It's been four years, hasn't it? Yeah, that's crazy, Kush, isn't it? Gonna go a little bit. Interesting. It's like a zoom or something. Uh, you're the space janitor. Yeah, we know nothing. All right, Wasta. Left control to crouch. Got it. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna do 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 do. I'm gonna crank up the mouse sensitivity just a wee bit. In memory of astronauts who par. Oh gosh. Okay. Perished in their pod too soon. Aw, uh, is it like beta tester or like backers or something? Nice. That's really cool. I like that. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> the perspective though. <laughs> For some reason in this perspective the, the text just goes off the off the thingy. Mm-hmm. Um alright, hydraulic storage. No. We wanna go to the escape pod. Mind your head. Well, thanks for letting this me know. This spot is a piece of junk, not worth any maintenance, but I don't make the rules. Anyway, I was supposed to reassemble the oxygen system. Could you do it for me? It's pretty straightforward. Sure. Could Trust you locate the oxygen system and open it? Uh, you should see three drawers against the wall. It's the top one. Yeah, definitely have the freaking janitor do that. What was the... Why not say Wasad? Uh, FGS robots, uh, Bin Bin. If you do the emote, if you do the FGS robot emote, it does it. Um, new astronauts routinely skip training. Well, I'm not an astronaut. I'm just a janitor. <laughs> hey, twitching slightly. Um, we're saying Wasda or Wasad. I think that's personal preference. Because I'm definitely a Wazda per- uh, yeah, I'm definitely a Wazda person. I'm not a Wasad person. Yep, this is the one. Uh, as you can see, it's empty. All the components are behind you on the workbench. Just grab a couple so we can get started. Okay, yeah, sure. Oh, God. Yeah, sure, I have a battery. Oh, it does tell you where it goes, though. Why do I have a feeling that in the actual game it's not going to tell you? Was there? We're saw Oh god, are we gonna like... Are we gonna fight about this now? An astronaut? I don't know, maybe? Power transformer. Yeah, I feel like in the actual game it's not gonna tell us. <laughs> the buzzer. Uh, sod. Oh. Or oh, Bin Bin going like... Bin Bin's over here like, I'm going to co completely go against the grain. Nobody go goes Dawes. <laughs> Master Caution. Wow, this is definitely freaking disassembled. A CRT. Just put all the components back inside the oxygen system. Uh, you can't get it wrong. They all only fit. Jerry, uh, you should be done by now. Just turn the oxygen system on using the on-off switch. I have some tin cans. Whoa, that's a hefty tin can. Bonk. Thick. <laughs> Why is this so amusing? Wait. Wait. <laughs> Why is this so amusing? Blonk. Alright, one. Wait. Nope, that didn't work. You go EQJK. Oh, I see. I'm trying to... I'm trying to stack him. Was D. Ooh, Marshall. That's. Ooh, Blanc. <laughs> Was it? Oh. Do French keyboard users use that QSD? Yeah, I, I guess. 
It's the way they don't bounce. Yeah, it's great. It's hilarious. Sorry. <clears throat> All right. Uh, do I push it? Oh no! Apparently, I turn it on first. Wait. Oh, F to well toggle. Uh, now we just need to check if everything is working properly. Could you look at the monitor and switch to the error codes channel? Can I not? Okay. Uh, God, this is this is on purpose, isn't it? Back, this is a totally on purpose. Like, if I'm standing, I'm way too tall. If I crouch, I'm way too low. That's on purpose, isn't it? It's like dri designed to drive you mental. Um, uh, how do I? Perfect. Um, now, as you can see, the oxygen bottle inside the system is empty. Could you swap it with the oxygen bottle located in the recycling station? Uh, yeah. But where is the recycling station? Oh, you're you're pointing at it. No, are you pointing at it? Bonk, bonk. Yeah, you are pointing at it. All right, this That's one. That's the one. Uh, the recycling station converts carbon dioxide into oxygen. Pretty useful, eh? That is anyway, pretty damn just, useful. Uh, replace the empty bottle with this full one. All right, we're done. Thank you, Jerry. Uh, you can go back to your cleaning trolley. Hi, Braxios. Damn it! Are you still there? Yes. I'm detecting a leak in the pod. Could you uh, get the leak feeler? Feeler? <laughs> uh, where is it? Hi, darkness. Hello. Welcome, Raiders. Sorry, we're currently in a space pod trying to learn how to do a space pod maintenance thing. Thank you so much for coming on over, uh, everybody. Really much appreciated. Hello, I'm FG. We're playing Tin Can today. Basically, we're currently doing the tutorial, but basically, you have have to abandon ship and you're in a space pod and you only have a technical manual, manual and you have to maintain the pod. That's like very out of date and broken. It's going to be great. Gonna be great. I hope you had a wonderful stream. Doing some city guesser there. Nice. All right, leak. You might have to climb a bit. Alert. Uh, you can grab a handle with your free hand to get closer to the leak. Oh God. Can oh. Once you get closer to the leak, just uh, aim at it and use the leak feeler to close it. Why does it? <laughs> Why do they call a feeler? <laughs> okay. So we can hold on. Nope. No. Not like that. We can hold on like this, and then we. Well done. I'm not detecting any leak anymore. Uh, we're all good. Thanks for your help. Anyway, I gotta go. This damn reactor is driving me crazy. Uh, no, no, put it, put it back there. Okay, okay, cool. Um, hey, Rochella, hello. Okay, that was that was the the first one. Wait, was it also vital vital needs? I guess it was moving interact and vital needs, right? Because vital needs leak sealer. Maybe. Jerry, if... can you hear me? Sorry to bother you again, but I'm stuck in the ship's engine room, and I still don't have time to take care of that damn Medusa escape pod. You're gonna have to get inside the pod again. Okay, sure. Ooh, can I go over it? No. Hey, everyone, did you? What is there? Electric storage. I want to explore the space station real quick, just a little bit. Interstellar transport crate mark four. Do not store flammable materials. There's a serious version of bra uh, breath it well i guess a little bit but basic so basically what it is i mean there is a little bit of humor uh oh that's me look at me is J i'm jerry this is jerry wait uh, yeah oh i can't pick it up i want to i want to look at the picture but i can't um it's like a survival game and you're only in the t in the pod and the only thing you get is a manual right now we're just doing the tutorial which is why we have somebody like guiding us along with words. Uh, and that's what's. Aww. There is an invisible wall there. But we're just the janitor, so we're getting advice, I suppose. We're going to check to see if the life support systems of the pod are working properly. I'm going to need you to turn them on one by one so we can check their values on their monitor. Okay. So, so this, this, is, this is what you get. This is what you get in the actual game. <laughs> yeah. March 2015. Oh my god, this thing is ancient. 
so yeah that's that's the thing that's that's the only thing you get to maintain your pod when you're actually playing the game uh first let's make sure that we have what we need to breathe properly all right i need you to find the oxygen system and to turn it on you can't miss it it's the top drawer with oxygen system written on it so on earth at sea level the atmospheric pressure is one bar and the oxygen level is around 20 percent that's our target as you can see we're all good here and the value is green but if the value turns red and drops below 16 percent you'll find yourself in hypoxia it's not a good thing as you can imagine the opposite is also true. Too much oxygen can also be deadly. So always keep an eye on these values. Oh, oh, Ice Cloud. Oh, you actor boss. Thank you. Oh, that is so helpful. Oh, that is so helpful. Thank you. So the pump inside the oxygen system diffuses the oxygen contained inside an O2 bottle into the air. Mm-hmm. Yes. Below the oxygen system, you'll find the carbon dioxide scrubber used to get rid of the excess of CO2. I need you to turn it on as well. That sounds like a smart idea. Good. You have to be aware that too much CO2 in the air is just as deadly as not having enough oxygen. Your body breathes O2 in and exhales CO2. The value should never rise above 6% at one bar. Mm-hmm. Now let's check the pressure generator uh, just below the CO2 scrubber. So this system is here to maintain the atmospheric pressure at one bar by releasing or capturing nitrogen in the air. The pod cannot sustain more than 1.7 bar, so be careful with too high pressures. It's also important to remember that the required oxygen levels and the lethal levels of CO2 vary depending on pressure. Yeah, he does sound French. Um, I'm pretty sure the deaths are French, so it makes sense. <laughs> uh, also, you said VR. Like, I wanna, I wanna say, um, yeah, they're working on a VR mode. Yeah, they're a French team of three uh, working on this game, and they are making a VR mode. Um, they're working on the VR mode right now. So the game was in early access. Um, and now it's in full release and VR mode is coming. Hey, Brett Dibble. Uh, and we have a key to give away as well. Now he definitely does does French. Like some, some, pronounce, some words are not quite pronounced properly. All right, we're good for the atmospheric systems. Now let's turn the temperature system on. It must be getting quite cold in here. Okay, that's a, te oh God, okay. You know, space is cold, but there is nothing there to efficiently transfer heat. I mean, sure, without heating, you'll eventually freeze to death. But in a pod like this one, equipped with a hot atomic pile, you need some way to stay cool if you don't want to be cooked. They were looking for testers for VR. Ooh. The temperature system hey, uses power to produce heat and liquid nitrogen to cool the air. I can tell you that cooling the air is very important when you're running the atomic pile at full power. All right, you should be feeling warmer now. That too. Uh, everything looks to be in order. Thanks for your help. You can go back to your work. And I have my own work to do to make sure our ship's reactor doesn't cook us all in the next few hours. See ya. He, he sounds like a, a French person that went to Australia for a bit and mostly has either correct pronunciation or australian pronunciation but then sometimes a little french sneaks in like the all right like the way he said the word all right for example that was very french but that's okay it's also 35 percent off yeah it's not very expensive um at all it's 10 pounds now with 35 percent off 1039 that's pretty that's pretty freaking good i'd say all right power management let's learn <laughs> may have watched too much neighbors to learn english hey jerry uh, Hi, it's me. me again i need your help with the pod it's 1169 for people paying in euros nice <laughs> yeah exactly but hey why not right sounds good to me <gasps> I can play tin ball. Wait, can I actually? Wait. Oh. 
you you have a you have a thing oh yeah zoom in on my picture yeah true 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 let's go do that oh yeah we look very much like we're out of our depth <laughs> So far, it's Firewatch in space. Well, a little bit because that, but this is because it's a tutorial. Hi, Mugains. All right. So oh. I'm going to cut the external power connection so we can test the new atomic pile. No. It's going to get dark in here, but don't worry, we'll bring life back to that old 10K. All can, right. Can we just not? Master warning. Press the reset. Okay. All right. I need you to find the main reactor. It's located on the ceiling above the gravity generator. I need you to open it. See, the way he said generator also is very Australian. Hi, Convoy. Hello. I think uh, we have surmised Convoy because this is a French studio. We have surmised that it's probably a French person that spent some time in Australia. Yep, you got it. Whoa. Uh, now Whoa. just turn it on, all right? What? Well, Okay, okay, what the heck just happened there? Oh, it came down. Okay, that was pretty weird because it kind of came down. That was strange. That was very Perfect. strange. You shouldn't see much of a difference right away. It yes. takes a moment for the atomic pile to warm up. The hotter it gets, the more power it produces. Okay, sure. Do you see the ammeter below the generator? So the red needle indicates the energy produced by the pile and the blue one indicates how much energy the active systems need to function. Okay. As you can see, it's above the red one. It means that the pile is currently not warm enough to produce all the required energy. Yeah, makes sense. Now, I'm going to remotely lock the pile temperature for some tests, but in normal circumstances, it's the processor plugged into the main generator that controls this temperature to provide the required amount of power. I guess I don't need to tell you what happens when it breaks down, huh? Hello, French. You can hear that as a source of a lot of the odd twinges. Yeah. Mm. That sounds like something in much later on between heat, power, output, etc. Yep. <laughs> this is going to get See, complicated. The pile temperature is stabilized and the needle is not moving anymore. Could you turn the main computer on so I can look at the system status? Damn it. I've Lock the temperature too soon. And there isn't enough power. Could you... Could you turn other systems off so we can save enough power to turn the main computer back on? Just keep an eye on the needles. You need to align them. Okay. Nope, that, that did like nothing. Uh, the CO2 to O2 recycling state... That doesn't... It's like... Oh god. Is he gonna have me like turn off all the things? I can't even see it anymore. Oh god, this is gonna be terrible. Oh uh, god. What else even is on? Oh, are we good now? No. Oh. The, the heater was Perfect. on. I'm getting the data. Thank you. You're welcome. Whoa. If you ever have to operate an atomic pile, keep in mind that it's slow, capricious, and that it can get very, very hot. So uh, always make sure to protect your systems with a fuse and a transformer in case of overload. Sure. Also, Frenzy, thank you for the follow. Hi, welcome. Anyway, it seems the new atomic pile is working fine. So that's it for me. And you can get back to your cleaning. Oh my god. You just, you just play this tutorial. And the only thing that it does is it shows you how terrible it's going to be once you're on your own. It's gonna be so bad. It's gonna be so bad, won't it? It's gonna be so bad. <laughs> oh god. Hey Jerry. I know, I know, this is the last time I swear. Just get back inside the pod. There is a problem with the oxygen system you reassembled earlier. 
I'm not saying it's your fault, but I need you to take a look at it for me. Okay? Yeah. Tutorials just a list of ways you can Thanks potentially again, die. Yes. You have no idea how much work it is to keep this escape pod in working order. Honestly, Foreshadowing, please. I, I would rather die than have to escape in this thing, even after a bunch of repairs. Th thanks. Thanks. Anyway, the oxygen system has a problem, and I need you to check the error codes channel on its monitor. Okay, I can, I can do Perfect. that. You should have the error list in front of you. The main computer usually translates the codes, but I had to take it offline for a while. I need you to find the pod operation manual. Every so, unfortunately, I can't really help you from here, so I'll let you browse the manual to find what the error codes mean. I'll let you grab the defective component once you figure out which one it is. Oh, and uh, do not forget to turn the system off before touching anything, all right? Yeah, thanks. Thanks, man. Really helpful. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, let's see. Wait, where do you see arrow codes? Oh, okay. Arrow codes. Oh, my God. You don't even put the arrow codes with the systems. You have to look through... You have to look through to find the error codes <laughs> oh my lord uh it's zero b e a all right it's on page 31 all right that power transformer is damaged all right all right so we have to switch out the power transformer got it all right off open Power yeah, transformer. I had a feeling this transformer wasn't working properly. I need you to use the repair station to fix it. Put the transform. Do you see the numbers on the repair station? So the top screen indicates how many spare parts are required to fix the components, and the bottom one, how many you currently have. So we don't have enough. We need to dismantle something else to get more spare parts. Just take the transformer out of the repair station. I, th I think I think they are, Convo. All right, so let's dismantle a component we don't need. I think I left a monitor on the workbench. Uh, put it inside the repair station, close the door, and press the dismantle button. Um, it says... Com yeah, 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 components. Yeah, yeah, there, there's, a, there's some odd French, French in there, but I mean, that just makes it more charming, honestly. Um... I think, I think, um, uh, the error codes are actually universal. Like, they all work for all of the different systems. And obviously, the manual is as obtuse as possible. Close the door? Close the door. Oh, okay. Um... And then dismantle. Well done. You now have enough spare parts to fix the transformer. You can throw the monitor away. It's dead now, anyway. Just put the transformer inside the repair station and press repair. I need to remember that F is the interact button. Have a slightly unusual accident in a futuristic game. Yeah, I like it too. I, I find it. I find it very nice. I like how this is like a figure futuristic escape pod, and then we just have a normal fire extinguisher. Back inside the oxygen system. Uh, make sure it's turned off first. All right. Well done. Oh, I was You're supposed really to turn it back on. Favor, so thank you. Uh, you can get back to your cleaning trolley, and I'm going to get back to work because this damn reactor is driving me mad. If it wasn't different error codes. Oh boy. Oh great. Jerry, the ship's cooling system just failed. Warning. The reactor, it's reactor going to blow. You need to grab evacuate as many components as you can in the storage oh. rooms and evacuate right now. No matter Warning. what you do, do reactor not leave aboard that damn. Evacuate to the nearest escape pod immediately. Oh, you nice. I, I, and this is I, was gonna, I was trying to look around and see if there was anything else. That you could actually grab because it says you have to grab components and go, but there was nothing to grab. Mm 
Uh, one of the games actually hand reverse between E and F, depending on whether on right, left or right click. Oh, really? Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. Use your self recharging flashlight. Oh, tab. Cool. All right. Um, best time so far. Oh, boy. Maintain your beacon on for rescues to find and unlock new components and systems to survive longer each time. Oh, I see. All right. Survive six minutes. Hey, Topher Monks, where we're supposed to go? No, nowhere. This was just the, this was the end of the tutorial. Yeah, it would have been cool if it were to just believe immediately into the same. Reactor meltdown imminent. But I guess. Evacuate to the nearest escape pod immediately. Uh. This is not a oh, yeah, I, I'm trying to, I'm already. Yes, I know. I played the tutorial. Thank you. Oh, God, that just went through there. Oh, yeah. I can do that and then that, can't I? Okay, I have, I have, I have a little bit of time left. I like, this is, you know what this reminds me of? Um, 60 seconds until the thingy happens. So we're just, we're just chucking things in there, chat. <laughs> Everything's on fire, yes. All right, I have a little bit longer. Hi, Kalu. Yeah, I think this is it. Uh. What? I was closing the door. <laughs> Apparently, I didn't close the door fast enough. <laughs> I did not close and eject in time. No, I did not. Well, we're gonna try again then. That was abrupt, yes. Apparently, I need to figure out how the frick we can do that faster. No, I did not close the hatch in time. So, we need to, we know now that we need a little bit more than five seconds. Wait, there was an eject button on the chair? I ejected accidentally? I didn't even see that. Oh god, this is gonna be terrible. Apparently I ejected. Well, that's a problem. This game is finished, Genoxis. Uh, it came out, in early, uh, out of early access uh, earlier this month. No, that's the... Oh. Okay. See, I would not have pressed that button to close the door on the escape put. Yeah. Oh, oh god. Okay. Maintain the, uh, the right or left click pressed while aiming at nearby handle to move around in zero G. Got it. Yes. But now there is no more zero G. Uh, left trigger and left crowd will move up and down when holding on a handle. Yeah, I've done that already. I did play the tutorial. Hello, uh, Dragon of Frost. Better some salvage I was around here just to get a lot of repair currency. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I, I was trying to do. Okay, oh, this is my rescue beacon. Okay. Um, everything is on. Wait, are you actually on? Yes. That is fine. Carbon dioxide scrubber. This thing is not on. The pressure generator wasn't on. So the problem is though, I just, I don't know what my power is like. I'm gonna, I'm gonna quickly check the power though. Uh, if you hit hands, you can disable them on settings. Oh, that is, that is just, well, oh, oh, okay, there's stuff like outside that we're hitting right now. Oh, oh, great. We're going through a freaking asteroid field. Thanks, Ice Cloud. Oh, this is terrible. What even is this? Power transformer. Oh, it's the, okay, it's the cooling. Oh god. 
Mommy, I want to go home. Oh god, that scared the crap out of me. All right, turn the flashlight on. Okay, that was because we hit something. I'm going to quickly turn down um volume though. That was a bit loud. <laughs> That was a bit loud. Okay, I feel like something just broke, but I don't know what broke. Oh, master caution, oxygen generator. Um, main computer is offline. Oh lord, that is a problem. Um, they never told me what to do about the main computer. <laughs> they never told me about. <laughs> The main computer. You get stressed playing this? Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Um, did you lose your freaking button? You did. All right. I need to open you. Um, uh, open. Wait, what was the open button? There we go. No, that's... Oh, that's you. Uh... You get stressed playing the Romantic? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, boy. No button, no monitor. Yeah. It's, it's yelling at me because of things. Um, let's see here real quick. Uh, main computer. <laughs> I just need to... Okay, wait. Main computer generate. There we go. 12. Uh, we're not the main computer. Error cost each should require you to check on the manual. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I see. I see why. But this was the problem fixed because losing consciousness for good. Yeah, I, I know what the problem is. Okay. Eh. 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 Oh, God. There we go. Um. NA82. What is NA82? Oh, God. This breathing. <laughs> there it is. Uh, low pump. Uh, pump's not working properly. Uh, I will... I guess turn you off? Where's the pump? Power connect... There is no pump! Oh, there is the pump. Okay. Oh god! Oh god. Oh god. This is, this is getting bad, Chad. You are not on. Oh god. Because you don't have a button! It doesn't even have a button! We're so dead! Hey, Xboxing! Hello! How are you? Yeah, yeah, I know, thank you. I know it's getting hard to, uh, to, to breathe. How are you doing today? Alright. No, start. Oh, great! This is, this is... Hi, Obi-Wan Jacoby! Hello! This is a problem. Um... Do, do you need a CRT monitor as well? No, you have them. I need a, oh, I do need a part in the door. Yeah. You're right. Does anything else have that part in the door, though? Looks like a little space pod thing. Um. Nothing else has that part. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. It's the cl close the, the, the door thing. That's right there. But the thing is... Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, we're dead. Um, I don't know where to get that part. Let me check something real quick. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Wasn't there... Wasn't there a way I can look at the... You had a spare pump on the floor. Uh, fair enough. Um. Oh, two isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll try again. <laughs> oh God. Okay. We need to grab more stuff. This is uh definitely, definitely stressful. You're definitely better than okay, we're dead. That's good. That's cl I'm glad to hear that. Awesome. That is good. <laughs> I'm a... Uh, yeah. Well, you, you saw. 
uh, what I was like. Why do I check Whitehall? No. Okay. I'm just grabbing things. Oh God, can I, do I? I'm risking, I'm being, I'm being, I'm being very risky. I'm being very risky, Chad. Okay, okay. Yeah, just take the whole boxes. I can't take the boxes. I can't take the boxes. The power connector. I'm not sure if it's the... I love how it dials. It like actually makes like the dialing noise. All the pumps and there's no buttons or anything similar. I do need buttons too. Cause um I need but oh god, that's your button. Cause literally my repair part does not come with any buttons. Like this thing does not come with any buttons also with nothing inside of it wow okay cool no repair station for me eh yes oh my god it's a freaking tape deck Ooh, tin cans okay cool oh i got my own little wilson that's cool Oh, that's cool. Hi, all there. How are you doing today? Hey, Nixumia. Good morning. Hello. So I feel like I want to. Oh, I can't. Jesus Christ, <laughs> that scares me so much. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, you're not even on. Um, main computer offline, okay. Zero BEA was, this is so stressful. Why am I doing this to myself on a Monday morning? The power transformer was damaged. Did I not grab another power transformer? No, I did not. I did not. This is great. There's a leak somewhere. Oh lordy. Okay. Um. Wait, wait. Was the filler? Wait. There's the filler. There's a leak. There's a leak. There's a leak. There's a leak. There. Uh. E. Okay. Fix the leak. All right. First problem. Uh. Done. Is there cheaper for opening the door? Probably. <laughs> uh, I don't know. All right, so I can't do anything about that right now. Oh no! 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 Um... Oh great! Great! Those are not numbers. Good morning, Pippi uh, Piggy Puppet. Hello. Oh Lord. Okay. Oh no. Oh. Oh God. And the and the thing is off now. Oh no. Oh God. Everything is offline. Um. Oh God. Oh, this is terrible. Everything is offline. <laughs> Okay, so this is the float effect. Is there a way I can like stop myself? Um, okay, we lost lots of power. But everything is off. Hmm. Oh great, my flashlight also. Oh no. Oh no, this is terrible. Which one was the one I have again? Is that blue or was that red? It was red, right? So what if you turn off 
floating effect. What does that do? Hi, Luke. Hello. Things are not going well. No. No, they're not. They are so not going well. <laughs> I can't even... Oh, God. Like, trying to orient yourself is so difficult. Um... So I can press those buttons, but they don't do anything. Um, how am I? <laughs> well, see, you know. Slightly stressed? <gasps> what? what? Oh no, there's no, nothing in there. Okay. Um, but no, I'm good. I'm good. This is, this is fun. I'll be very difficult. It's Friday. Because I'm trying to figure out. Oh God! This light, this freaking light. <laughs> this is terrible. Hey SLB. You want to open the door? You want me to open the door? Chat just wants me to open the door. All right. No, I, 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 I unlocked it. <laughs> I can't actually open the door. It's not letting me because of pressure. Oh, I think I'm outside. No, yeah, it's not letting me because of pressure. Uh, because uh, the pressure inside is still so strong. Wait, wait. Oh God, I'm in. I'm inside of everything. Um. They are freaking drawers with stuff in it. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I survived seven minutes and 23 seconds. Hey, we lasted long enough. Cool. Um, yes, everything is simulated. So if you if you change like pressure, it'll have an effect on everything. Um, but but I didn't even see that they were freaking storage. Um us we learned something from this yes yeah uh-huh indeed indeed what the heck oh gosh this is a secret sequel to alien no thank you i know norm i know we did that on purpose we did that very much on purpose no no we are absolutely not commander rudd no no bad commander rudd mm -mm. Also, cat, could you could you decide where you want to lie down, please? Alien jump scares? No, alien jump scares is boo. That's very much boo. It's very much boo. So theoretically, we should have now. Wait, what? But it, but I, it said seven minutes and twenty three seconds. Wait, did that not unlock it? What? No, Rochelle, not yet. I have five more days. Wait, it. You lost power, no beacon. Oh, yeah, okay, fair enough. True. Could you please lie down, cat? You're being such a butt. There. Yeah. Goodness, sorry. Uh, is there a jump? There was no jump scare. No, Obi Wan. There's no ju jump scare. Not like that, at least. Hey, Dustin Ovis. Hello. Good to see you. There, there is no jump scares like that. There is stuff crashing and burning and popping and breaking, but there is no like aliens or anything like that. That's not the point of this game. Your pain, the, the point is um, you only have a manual and you have to survive. <laughs> uh, well, because the, the, yeah, it's like one of those, one of those games. Oh God. My God, I think it's actually the hundred bits. Whoosh. You lost power to the beacon, so nobody came to save your bacon. That's true. Nobody fought the bacon beacon. What's in this tin can? I am. I am. My God, I think it's for the hundred bits. Appreciate it. And good morning, Soul Adams. Hello. Also, yes, space is uh, space is pretty awesome. All right, core meltdown. There we go. 
So apparently there's stuff in that in those drawers too, which I didn't freaking realize. Spam in a can. Does spam come in not a can? Uh, I'm gonna get one more pump. These are all pumps. I don't need more pumps, I reckon. I'm gonna get a fuse. No, I don't I don't play spoopy games really like that. So you good. Obi Wan Obi Wan. Uh we'll see our team monitors. I wanna take two of those. Eh. Alright. Let's go. F. For some reason, I always want to click it with a mouse and not press F on that. Okay. Yes, there is a tiny one. We also have a we also have a Wilson friend. Okay, so. I have this. I could put that in there. But then I also, I totally didn't realize that. See, there, there was like crap in here. And I didn't know that. So we can, we can. Like clean up a little bit and, and store our things. I think there's also that's also where pumps go because basically now i've learned that you know all right cool i have no batteries dark twins thank you so much for the raid hello welcome raiders how's it going hello how are you doing today uh we're trying to survive in space and it's going um <clears throat> great yeah mm-hmm Hey Yoshi Tails, welcome. Hello, hello. Okay, I'm feeling like I'm missing a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, apparently that's going going very slowly. I'm trying to figure out where the heck oh, Jesus Christ, that scares me every time! Stupid asteroids! There's a fire! Ah! <laughs> There's a fire! Nobody told me about that! Uh, eat! Are we good? Are we good? We good, okay. <laughs> it's a fire! Oh god, oh my god, every time! It just scares the crap out of me. Um, but Dark Twitch, thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate it. How are you doing today? Hey, Mosaic Task Force. Hey, Necron. Okay. Yes, the pressure thing is indeed off. Okay, O2 is okay. That's okay. Temperature is okay. Um, the main computer is off. Line. Honestly. Is nobody driving this thing? Uh, the temperature is okay. The pot atmosphere is okay. Oh, breathability, pressure, nitrogen, CO2, O2. Gotcha. <laughs> Those servers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no problem. Oh, this is the recycling station. Yes, yes, yes. Is there anything in here? No, of course there isn't. Of course there isn't. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Every time it scares me so much. Okay, that's just a handle. Okay. I still haven't stored these things because I got distracted. Okay. Oh boy. I don't... Okay, did we make it through? Did we make it through? Right. We're gonna... There we go. Now we've cleaned up, mostly. Yes, good. Uh, except for that. I don't know. I don't think that thing... Yeah, no, that thing doesn't go there. So I don't think I can actually use the power station just yet. Did you see the power toggle from the O2 to turn on the main potato? Um, I need the O2 though. <laughs> Are we still... What's going on out there? 
Oh, oh wait, shift is up, right? It's just the freaking blackness of space, that's it. I think everything is okay. Nothing seems broken. Wait, you stopped. What's happening? Um my 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 rescue being stopped. Counting down. I don't like that. Okay. Okay. <laughs> don't touch it, apparently. Did I just kill myself? I think I just executed myself. I did. <laughs> yeah, well, don't, don't grab power converters that are currently literally being used. It's not a good idea. <laughs> it does tell you that, though. It does actually tell you that. I mean, the game does. Yeah, electricity is... I mean, electricity is scary and dangerous. Yeah. It's fine. Achievement unlocked? Well, maybe. I don't think so, though. Eh. I feel like I'm grabbing stuff I don't need. Why? What the? Eh. There is just, just crap stuff here. There's only crap stuff here. They changed the, 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 the locations on me, it feels like. Okay, whatever. <clears throat> okay. Um. Mm-hmm. This is fine. This is fine. We're fine. Maybe. I love that it's like the dial-up sound that they have for the rescue beacon. I love it. Okay. First of all, turn you on. Uh, would we try trust me to save you in a space crash? Oh, don't. I know. No I know nothing. So that's a broken CRT com monitor, I reckon. Right? Because it's not showing anything, even though the thing is on. Yeah. Okay, so already fixed a thing. Yeah, we have one minute at the start to get uh, stuff. All right, so that's good. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder... Hmm. I don't know... I don't know what else I need... To fix this. Ooh, okay. I feel like we kind of have to learn what we need to fix that. You know what I mean? Um, there's a hoop. Can you unfold it and play basketball with Wilson? I know you can play. I know you can unfold it. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Every time! It scares me so much and I don't know why. Master warning, yes. Okay, I need an on and off switch though. I can just take your on and off switch, right? You'll just still be on. Yes, okay. But what else does it need? Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, there's a leak. It didn't tell me this time. Uh, where was it? Where was it? There it is. Jesus. And I dropped it. Did I? Yes, I did. Ah! <laughs> this is so bad! Okay. Jeez. <laughs> Don't... I, I honestly never ever 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 jeez it's 
so oh god what's what's sparking okay i uh, i do have a manual yes but the manual is not going to tell me what goes into this thing i'm pretty sure it doesn't tell me uh what goes into the repair station yeah it doesn't tell you what goes in it you're off, gonna be off in the meeting sounds good a uh, general chaos mm, um actually fun fact uh okay that's empty uh vr is coming ah oh, god vr is coming they they are going to there will be vr yeah i need something to put into there okay let's see that temperature is fine breathability is fine that one's still counting down oh those are lights those are the emergency lights what if i stop the emergency lights and then is this what I need? No, I already have one of those. What is the big thing that goes into there? Big town. I don't know. I don't know what goes it. What that is that goes into there. Yeah. So we pass through the asteroid fields. The battery. Okay. Uh. <laughs> No, if I turn you off. No, there's also nothing in here. Hmm. Oh, they make things work with that. Oh, yeah. Okay, that would make sense. Yeah, no, I don't think it's needed. I need a power converter. I think I need a power converter. No, that's a buzzer. Data connector. That not a power thingy it's a large power connector hey wait no data though i still don't know though what goes into the door there so this one was broken hey okay 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 we dismantled it all right can i dismantle you no okay so i'm i made things okay jerry can you hear me oh it's me i'm a board rescue ship we're almost there just keep your beacon online a few more seconds so we don't lose you Okay. I'm bring you home, right? Sure. Uh, what's the oh god? What's the problem now? No. Nope. What's the problem? Oh god. Oh god. I think I did it though. I think I did it. <laughs> I think I did it. We almost died again. What's fine? Flying. Thank you for the host. Appreciate it. God, this is so stressful. I got rescued. I made it 5.59 out of 6 minutes. I don't know how I did that, but hey, we got the large battery now, though. Nice. We did it. <laughs> Hacks? Yes. Hey, Mosaic. It is so complicated. Holy, holy smokes. But we did it. We did it. We did do it. I wonder what you get the achievements for. Make it through the asteroid field. I feel like we did. I feel like my achievements might not be working. Finish one ranking game. Make it through five asteroid. Oh, do I have to play ranked games? Maybe. Mm. I wonder if you have to. If this is like the the idea is to play rescue first to unlock stuff. So you can play. Yeah, I think it's ranking. The music is great. Yeah, you can you can buy. Okay. A party game. Let a friend help you out with the PDF version of the part manual. Error codes are left encrypted and the manual is gone from the part. You can find it in your library or Steam store page. 
<laughs> if it's not just difficult enough. <laughs> Though, to be fair, honestly, chat, honestly, that could be fun for Friday, uh, for Saturday. If I play that with Lex, it's like keep talking, nobody explodes, but even just more, just more harder. Yeah, it can play with Lex and like chat can help out. Mm. It does sound exactly Luxol. Yeah, absolutely. We we might do that. We might do that on Saturday, at least for a little bit. And Luxol, thank you for the follow. Hi, welcome. That sounds hilarious. Okay, so that's okay. I got it. I got it. So I think I wanna. Mm, I don't know. Uh, chat can sabotage. Yeah, ranked training. Aim for the long survival time and beat the community. So the question is. Do I need to play rescue first to unlock the components or in ranking do I just have all the the tutorial like the the, the stuff available? Let's see. I'm just gonna try it. Whatever. Screw it. <gasps> do you not get to pick anything? <gasps> I don't think I get to pick anything. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> you don't have to? Okay, that's good to know. Oh god. Rescue sounds like the tutorial. Yeah, a little bit. Though... Oh god, there's a timer. Alright. Okay, so how's the how's the storage looking? Are you kidding me? <gasps> oh, okay, there's a, there's a tiny amount of stuff in the storage. Okay, oh, there's a large battery. That's good to know. Alright. Empty. All right, ready. Can I put a tit on oh, no. her? Wait, eh? This definitely works, right? No, it doesn't. <laughs> you can only dismantle components. You are not allowed. You can't even dismantle that. I can't dismantle the tape recorder. Can't dismantle poor Wilson. Wait, did it turn? Did it turn motion blur back on? No, that was weird. What was happening to poor... What's happening to poor Wilson there? <laughs> Confused. But... Uh, eh. I did it, and I got an achievement for it. Thank you. Thank you. I'll be here all week. And Saturday, too. Hello, Arch! Hi! Hello! How are you doing? Yeah, for, for some reason, the ball has motion blur. It's great. Hey, Avalok! Okay, this is fine. Okay. If if stuff keeps going like this. Oh wait, asteroid field detected. Collision imminent. Yeah, alright, cool. Cool. Alright, that's um now stuff is going to break. This is gonna be great. <laughs> oh god. Uh oh said FG could play in a tin can and make it entertaining. Ah, that spoops me so hard every time. I hate it. All right, just check in. What's the temperature? Power temperature is fine. Everything seems to be working. Asteroid field detected. Yeah, I know. I just wanna. I just wanna quickly see how much, like, how good we are on the energy. Ooh, okay. That's okay, that's the okay. Whoa! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Now stuff is starting to... Oh God. Oh God, what am I doing? <laughs> there... I mean, it's not jump scares per se, it's just collisions. Right? That's fine. Out of order for maintenance. We'll fix it all for 5 p.m. inspections. It's not like anyone is going to need to use this Old tin can anyway. Ah ha ha. William B Sector. There is no rescue. There are no rescue. Oh god. Jesus Christ. Uh there was a caution light. There was a caution light. Was there? Oh, oh, there's a there's a caution light here now. And the O2. Error list. Oh lord, um... Is 
Oh god, the the scrubber. Okay, let's see. Error list. Systems list. Okay, fire, 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 fire. <laughs> oh my god, this is so stressful. Uh, uh, e. Okay. Um, great, now it's broke. It's broken now, this is great. Sounds like rain, it's very relaxing. Yeah, 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 this is fine. Uh, okay, we survived that. I guess the CRT monitor is broken. Uh, require parts 70 to repair it. I have, I have nothing though. Do I have another display? I don't. Poor Wilson? I can't do poor Wilson. Our lord. Um, what if I do the large battery? This is, I'm gonna regret this so hard. No repair needed. Oh, really now? Wow, okay, that gave me like nothing. Um... Well, crap. So, it's working, but not very well. Punching me for the title? I did nothing, Osama. Also, hi. Hello. It says there are no errors. I guess everything is working prob properly. Except for the fact that the monitor itself isn't working. So that's a problem. Yeah, I know, Cat. That is a big problem. The oxygen bottle is okay. The CO2 bottle is okay. Scavenge the main lights. So the lights don't do much. What is this? That's the... Yeah, this is the... Uh, CO2 to O2 station. Battery fast charger. Apparently there's stuff in there that I can't open. Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna wreck the emergency lights. I'm sorry, emergency lights! Ding! Oh no, the battery is not empty. Uh, the battery is dismantled. <laughs> I dismantled it. Okay, what's with O2? Uh, low... Oh god, I need to remember this. Low oxygen at most, low pump. Is that because... Wait, off? You're empty, yes. Okay, bonk. Take this. Put that in there. Okay, put you back there. Low oxygen atmosphere. Okay. That's fine. It was just to switch the thing. Right? It's fine now? Oh, the breathability is crap. Why is the breathability crap? Are you not actually... Oh god, I think I need to repair this CRT monitor as well. Is it time to panic? Eee, yeah, slightly. Slightly, definitely. Ice nebula detected. Atomic pile output limited. It does say though, it's working. But I guess it's not. Okay, the temperature is fine. Or is it getting better? No, breathability is absolute utter crap. Because this thing is completely broken. I just don't know what in it is broken. Oh, the bottle. Oh, gosh. Okay, I know what the problem is. I think. At least to some extent. I think the bottle was just full. Why are we hyperventilating? Uh, because we don't actually know how much CO2 is in the uh, in the air. Uh. So 
So, yeah. That's our problem right now. We, uh... Okay. <laughs> and this says... Oh, there's something on a... Okay, running on a battery. But yeah, this is uh, the, the carbon dioxide scrubber is broken. The thing is just... We don't know what in it is broken. No repair needed. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. This is stressful. <laughs> but hey, we made it. Eight, nine minutes. It's fine, right? <laughs> That's fine. Uh, is O2 negative again? No, I was actually. Do we have a rip counter? No, we don't. Hey, Zoe. No, no, the O2 is fine. See, the O2 was fine. The carbon dioxide at 20% was a little bit incompatible with life. <laughs> a little bit. <gasps> That's hard blocking it with a hammer. I don't have a hammer. Hi, Melon Pansu. Yeah, I don't have a hammer. Trent, I need to blow my nose real quick. Give me one moment. It's CO2 positive. Yeah, exactly. I need to blow my nose. Give me one second. I think it's the filter, probably. Oh, I can give the kid, the kitty cat, the treat now because he got up. Use the fire extinguisher. Oh, that's a good idea. All right, cat wants treats. Right, go, 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 they're right there, friend. Right there. Alright, start again. Oh, what did I do now? Uh oh. Did I break it? No. Okay. Wait, did that actually? Okay, I guess we. I... Yeah, okay. Well, I guess we're in rank mode. <laughs> Hi, Caracas! The CO. The extinguisher adds CO2 in the air. I think it does, because it is a CO2 based. Oh, is that why? Wait, let's test. Oh, apparently we made it through an ice nebula. <laughs> that might actually, because because these systems interacted with each other in this game. So that may have actually been the issue. That may have actually been the issue. Right, asteroid field imminent. Okay, cool. So you're fine. So, oh, so you just start with randomized stuff. Got it. We just start with randomized equipment uh, in this mode. Copium, copium for what? Lance! Thank you so much. Lance, thank you so much for 33 freaking months of support. That is incredible. How are you doing? Thank you so much for keeping up yourself for almost three years. Um, um, a space survive. Um, yeah. <laughs> How, uh, so about that. No, 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 we do have some stuff. Like, look at that. There's a CRT monitor. And we have some buttons. Uh, hey purple traitor yeah you have that in um survive like in in the survival training mode this is ranked mode and there you can't grab anything but there is still a mode where you can go and grab stuff it's just in ranked you just you just start with a random assortment also hi purple traitor good to see you hello hello uh it's been crazy busy with work you managed to get a stream yeah hi it's so good to see you yeah, so there is a mode where you get rescued, then there's training for this, and this is ranked mode, where it's just about surviving as long as possible. Mm-hmm. Jesus Christ, that scares me every time. Yeah, in this mode, there is a no rescue beacon. It's out of order for maintenance. So 
to be fair, trying to survive this is kind of futile anyways, because you don't have any food or drink. So it is kind of futile. Just checking the uh, CO2 bottle there. To see how full that one was. Also, how full is the O2 bottle? I swear. Mm, that just scares the crap out of me every time when it goes bonk. There we go. Uh, someone wrote the out of order note. Well, they didn't let me blast off in it. It was the only one that was around. So I went in it and I clearly I didn't see that out of order sign. So there's that. All right, we'll just go and have a little sit down. Coco! Oh my God. <laughs> Hi, Coco. Thank you so much for spending your prime sub here for the 20 fifth month as well thank you so much for the continued support over two heckin years thank you so much i really appreciate it the pressure is okay co2 is holding steady o2 is holding steady where was the nitrogen system again up here wasn't it what do we whoopsie liquid nitrogen bottle how do we oh god oh god oh god there's a leak i hear a leak i hear a leak this is bad okay we fixed it <laughs> yeah the spaceship was blowing up exactly silver streak yeah thank you so much both of you lance for the 33 and coco for the 25 this is an escape pod yeah yeah Basically, the, the reactor on the main ship goes bakoom and uh, you escape in this thing. So it's kind of a, uh, this is, yeah, this is our only way to survive. Okay, systems are okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember. How the liquid, like the nitrogen system works. Um, yeah, I don't remember how that works. Um, I don't know how much actually carbon dioxide nitrogen at present. Nitrogen 73. All right. Wow, cat, I know. Yeah, I don't remember how to how to fix this. Because I think our nitrogen is a bit too... Yeah, our nitrogen is a little bit too high. But I don't remember how you fix this. Wow. Because we have nitrogen there. This is the temperature. pressure system oh dirty filter low pump yeah yeah yeah, yeah. okay uh, oh shoot <laughs> dirty filter so i guess that's the air filter huh oh, it is dirty it also has for some reason motion blur no repair needed how do i empty it out do i just take it out have to clean it oh it says right there duh thanks yeah it's reading helps i've I, yeah meow and then oh it was on battery for a while oh god the co2 scubber scrub, scubber scrubber is now going mental again though um low temp bad data it has bad data stop which means probably well first of all cat no clean that where's the data connector wow 
Where the heck is the data connector in this thing? Because it must have it somewhere. Whoop, goodness. What's beeping at me? Uh, cat, what are you doing? Oh, the temperature. Oh no, everything's beeping at me. Oh lordy. Star detected. Temperature rising. Um. Do I go here and turn it off? I guess I turn the I turn the thingy off, the power off. Does that make it stop? Not really. Beep boop, beep boop. I know. Yeah, the, the CO2 is also having a problem. Things are heating up, yes. The problem is... Oh, I just switched that out while I was running. Uh-oh. Is it still really hot? Yeah, it's still pretty dang hot. God, this music is creeping me out. I don't rem I don't know how. Oh boy, oh boy. How to turn that off? Also, that's a bit loud. I'm gonna turn this down just a smidgen. There we go. Yeah, that I haven't learned how to do. Pressure cook? No, the pressure is fine. The pressure is fine. It's temper temperature. Yeah, the temperature is crap. And our breathability is crap as well. Battery pump, CRT monitor, air filter, power transformer. But we're getting bad data. Oh, there is the data connector. All right, let's 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 do this. Okay, we did it. We we went past the star. Um. Darn it! Darn it! So close, though. No, 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 no. We got it. We got. We got. Yeah. So. I could not fight the data connector and the CO2 thing. Hey, over nice fox. That's not how it works. Hey, Fluffy Red Panda. We we were okay. We actually made it past the star. See, the temperature in the pot was already going down again. So turning off the generator is what you want to do when you go past the star. Um, but uh, yeah, exactly. Yes, LB. The problem was the CO2 thing, and I just because it said bad data. And I just could for the life of me not find the data thingy when I looked there for the first time. And then the temperature thing started. How do you and then the alarms go off. And then you just go like super duper 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 crazy. No, it's fine. No, it's all good seizure. This is this is this is perfect. Also, hi seizure, hi Cresseria. Hello, hello. No, no, no. It's fine. We're learning. We we survived longer. We did ten and a half minutes. And this is also the only mode where you can get achievements. So all good. We did it. Seizure! Why? Why get this music like suddenly get so loud? Because this one isn't. I think that one is just that settings just not affected by the menu music sound settings. But um, seizure! Thank you so much for six eighteen months of support. Thank you so much for the tier freaking three. Resub, you uh, freaking boss, you. Thank you so much for the support. I really appreciate it. Hey, Viking! Wanna hear a joke about paper? Sure. Hit me. You uh, done it with your food. Never mind, it's terrible. Nice, nice one. Nice one. <laughs> Off to the pungent with you. That's clearly where you want to be. 
again. Oh, thank you, SLB. Uh, and you, you had food, and we didn't have any food with me. That's rude. Didn't have any food for me, Crisaria. That's rude, yeah. <clears throat> faster than FG. You were faster than me. That's good, Tar. That's good, yeah. Mm-hmm. Perfect. This is really fun, though. It's so stressful, but it's also really fun. You live in the pungent? Yes, you do. D uh, what it? Okay. What's happening today? <laughs> Vikram and Raiders. Hello, welcome. How was a dwarf fort? I hope you had lots of fun. Thank you so much for coming on over. Hi. Uh, hey, Gammon. Welcome. Hello. Holly, hello, hello. How are you all doing? Um, that's what we're doing right now. We're turning into skeletons into space. We're playing tin can. Um, basically, you have a manual and an escape pod, and you try to survive. It's great. Uh, hey, Masterlith, hello. How are you doing today? <laughs> dwarf fort was too short for you. More dwarf fort. Hmm. Thank you so much for coming on over there. I really appreciate it. Yeah, we're we're trying to survive in space and I'm FG and this actually by the way is Panda Bear. There is just a thingy in the way. There we go. Now there's also a cat in space. You haven't heard of this one? Yeah, I got I got a kite for it. Um last week because it came it wasn't early access and it came out last week on the 12th. It's really fun. It's so heckin' freaking stressful, but it's really, really fun. <laughs> and, and thank you so, so, so much for the raid. I do really appreciate it. Pet the kitty. The kitty's gonna get up if you pet the kitty, though. But pet the kitty. He's still gonna get up, though. Yep. He's gonna get up. See, I told you. Making the kitty cat go away. Ow, 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 God, you have freaking claws. Ow, my poor shoulder. My poor shoulder. Well, he might come back later. Thank you so much for coming on over, though. I'm just taking a quick, quote unquote, break from the game because it's really hard to talk to chat. <laughs> What's the leaderboard? How long have people freaking survived? Do I even want to know? It's a bit difficult to talk with chat when you try to do the survive because it gets so stressful five hours five hours what <laughs> jesus christ um wait is that oh is that a total wait is that total oh that's i think that's total survived Not just in one go, right? Electrocution. Yeah, that's definitely not happened to me. I've not electrocuted myself with this. No, never. <laughs> but yeah, so basically in the smart, you just go into the into the uh, escape pod because the ship is, well, the reactor is going nuclear. It's not total. Okay. It did say 10 deaths. Yeah, stonewash. And then my total was in the bottom left where it said 19 minutes. So it must be total. And then, then this is your escape pod. This is it. And um, you get a random assortment of stuff in these... Well, in these drawers. What do we get? We get an on-off button. Great. Uh, wow. Um, we get a fuse. And that's it. Wow. Wow, we got nothing, nothing. <laughs> An on off button and a fuse. And then you have like lots of systems to maintain. So this is this is the temperature system for inside the pod. Um, lights and emergency lights. Uh, the rescue beacon is offline, no rescue beacon. This is atmospheric conditions. So uh, temperature of the generator, how much power the generator is providing. Uh, O2, CO2, nitrogen, and pressure inside everything. Um, whether or not the temperature is okay, breathability of the um, the atmosphere inside. O2 generator, CO2 scrubber, pressure generator, 
Um, this turns CO2 into O2. Um, this is our repair thing. Uh, to repair though, you need repair parts, which means you have to chuck in something else to dismantle it. Uh, we are coming into an asteroid field and this is our main computer. Um, and then we have the gravity generator down there and the actual power generator up there. It's, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's a thing. And then you get a manual here. And then at the end, you have all of your uh, error codes that you can look up unless you have a bad data cable. And then you can't because you can't read any of the data. Great. Um, I think to prepare prepare i'm gonna go take i'm gonna take the on off button and already freaking uh dismantle it because i need some i will need some repair parts bonk we only get 15 though so that like gives us nothing and now that thing is just useless uh can i mine the asteroids nope nope sarmation i'm just in a, in a freaking escape pod that's practically already falling apart <laughs> So unfortunately I cannot. We are leaking. We are oh god. We are leaking indeed. Uh there we go. Is that it? That is it. So yeah, you, you'll start to have holes and you fill them with hole fillers and yeah, all of that sort of stuff. It's sometimes a bit hard to hear the leak. But uh Yeah. We're 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 so so far okay. But then also, like, for example, in, in these systems, like in the O2 scrubber, uh, the CO2 scrubber, there are air filters, and you have to clean the air filters, they get dirty. Um, and then here, the O2 will get empty. I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch it out already. Um, with that. There's another leak. I thought I was hearing something there. And then, um, the CO2 bo bottle. Uh, and then you can turn that into that. When a game, there's a game like this, but you're stranded in a snowstorm in your car. Probably? At least that sounds like something that could exist. Um, okay, everything is fine. There are no errors anymore, any, anywhere at the moment. Good. So yeah, it's <laughs> very stressful, but also kind of fun. And there's also a party mode, um, kind of like keep talking and nobody exploits. Um, you, uh, well, you don't have the manual and you have somebody on a call with you and they have, they have the manual. What happens to the carbon? That is a good question. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, oh, did I turn it off? No, it's on. No, it's on. It's on. See? It's very slowly going down and this one's going up. We good. So far, so good. So far, so good. Everybody, Everything is okay. And we can go chill for a little bit and just sit down on our chair. <laughs> you want to play Oni again? Mm-hmm. I know, right? We can, we can just play, play a couple of couple of rounds of uh, super motion blurry uh, b-ball let's go Whee! play some tin ball <gasps> oh the, the, the Wilson bounces I didn't realize that Wilson bounces oh, man. great but yeah um, no this is this is really fun it's super silly but really fun I do also have a key to give away so how about we quickly do this and we fire up the giveaway already. Uh, exclamation mark enter. The giveaway is going to be open for an hour. <gasps> so people have enough time to enter. And you've got to be here to claim the key uh, in an hour from now. So at 12 BST. Put that down here. And uh, you can win a copy of this game. They have, um, they have uh, VR planned as well. Uh, it's Honk. not, it's not, it doesn't exist yet, but they're working on VR. Ne that's the next thing, because the game was in early access, now it's fully released, and VR is coming. They're working on it. Oh, 
okay, now I know what the heck I did with this stupid desktop. Uh, where the heck did you... Oh. Okay, I sorry, I messed up my Twitch dashboard. I need to fix it. I need to fix that. Twitch mobile sucks! That's true. It does indeed. Mr. Holson, thank you for the follow. Welcome. Hello. <laughs> I do need to fix that. Um, enter and win. That's not how it goes. That's not how it goes. Havoctus, thank you for the follow too. Welcome, welcome. All right. I don't trust it. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Electromagnetic, uh, electromagnetic activity. Power surge is imminent. That seems like a bad thing. Um, why does it say caution? Yeah, you say caution too. But I, I think we're okay. Time for electrocution? Hopefully not. Oh, what the heck is going on here? Bad power con. Uh, Verter, I guess. Launch battery. Uh, power connector. Not converter, connector, I think. This game needs checklists. <laughs> yeah. Oh. It looks almost like a sky outside now rather than space. Right, this is good now. Oh, there's the electric magnetic. Why does it sound like a thunderstorm? It just sounds like a thunderstorm. Okay, I guess what you want to do is you want to go through the systems that have like an errorless monitor and just check those. Don't you? Okay. Yours. Ow! My, my everything. Oh God. Okay. Um, where is it? There it is. Eh, come here. No, I'm trying to I'm trying to get there. All right. Whoa gosh. Wait, where is it? Nope. Eh, I'm too far away. I'm too far away. <laughs> is there more? It's still making the noise. But I don't know where. I don't know where, and I get pushed away by the CO2. Hey, Mr. Toofy, how are you? Oh, it is still burning. Oh my god, this is so difficult. <laughs> Behind the panel. Yeah, I can't, I can't open it. And I'm so slow. Like, oh, now I can. There we go. Okay, did we do it? Yeah, we did do it. Okay, now there's a freaking crap ton of CO2 in here. And everything... Oh god, everything is offline. Oh god. Eh. Uh. Yeah, there's a lot of CO2 now. And I think you're offline too, aren't you? Eh. Yes, okay. Something is beeping. I don't know what's beeping. You're beeping. Okay. Eh. Where are, where's my where's my stuff? I'm so disoriented. Oh here, okay. Uh okay. Main component main computer offline. Oh no. Oh no. On. Oh god, everything is broken. <laughs> this is so terrible. Good morning, kids. It is, yes. And hi, Zamana. Hello, hello. Are you not? Oh my god, this floating, floating around thing is so difficult. Okay, you're on. 
I'm gonna turn you on as well. And you. I don't know what the problem is. Right now I can't tell. There's too much going on. Okay. I think we made it past the thing. But the problem is this is still offline. Yeah, it's still offline. But maybe, maybe the, the atmosphere pressure is like insane as well. Yeah, we died. Electric nebula, a bigger step. 11 and a half minutes. So there was no oxygen. <laughs> There's so much like the problem. The biggest problem I think that I have is when the lights just turn off. Hi, Giggles. Good morning. And then you only have like the tiny light and the light is also timed. Like the the, the flashlight um, is timed as well it is so mental <laughs> the generator got broke by the storm yeah though i don't know how to fix it i don't know how to fix it this would be so fun oh in multiplayer where you have one person telling the other what to do yeah we're probably gonna do that at least for part on saturday i think so um, i'm to make a world record run i want to check something real quick with a leaderboard because I, th I think it's total time, but I'm not sure. Yeah, because for me it says 31 minutes now. I don't know, yeah, because they have, they have this time, but then they have three deaths here. And there's 19 deaths in this. 10 deaths in this. I don't know. I wonder if that's, if that's total. I'm not sure. You were in, I wasn't expected to be out, but work hard. You gotta go in. Aww, rude. That's so rude. Yeah, but it wouldn't. It wouldn't have the the deaths in it. That's the thing. Like, why does it list deaths? So I think it's yeah. Mm. I don't know. Our best time so far was eleven minutes and twenty nine. How many tries it took? Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. But then my time in the bottom left is adding up. And it says 268 more minutes until I reach rank silver. So there's definitely a cumulative, cumulative time. Hey, SL Kitty. Hello, hello. Also... 20... Yeah, no, I managed to survive 20 minutes in ranking. No, it is... It's definitely... It's definitely... Cumulative. Yeah, it's cumulative. Diamond is five hours cumulative. Experience every possible death. Five ice nebula, five electric, five stars. Finish all rescue scenarios. Finish all challenges. Oof. All right, that's something else. Hey, friendly. Hey, Ber hey, Abert. How are you? But there you go. So it is. It is cumulative. That's good though, I like it. Alright, asteroid field detected. Collision imminent. Cool. Take uh, yeah, take on, on me, exactly. That's what we're doing. Me. We're taking on taking on the asteroid field. Take we have like nothing. We have a buzzer. Great. Do I literally have a buzzer and that's it? I swear, screw you freaking too. I have a buzzer, and that is it. I, I get a buzzer. And that is it. A buzzer. This. This thing. This is the only thing I get. I'll dismantle it for parts. Hey, Valdo! Hello! I swear. What a big troll. Oh, there, there they are. There they are. Rude? What, me? I'm not rude. I'm not rude. The game's rude. Jesus. Every time. Wait. 
Was that just sparks? That was just sparks. Okay. So low means it's when it's getting to that. Yes. I'm just switching this around already. Oh god! <laughs> okay, so you can just let that out if you want to. As well. Great. Sweet. You can just let... You can just grab this and just... Uh, oh, but so that means I could theoretically grab the oxygen bottle if I need to at some point and just open it, right? If I just do that and then... Yeah, I can open and close it as well. How's the surviving going? Not well. Not well. That's good to know, though. In a pinch... Ow. God, we must already have, like, a such a bad concussion in a pinch that's gonna be really helpful have a good one as well never blame me thanks for hanging out appreciate it in a pinch that's gonna be really helpful yeah i i, I just don't understand do i hear a leak Yes, I hear a leak. It's so subtle. Ow! Goodness. The leak noises are so subtle. I don't hear them when I'm talking. Hey, Ranger! You should go to bed. But hi. Hello. How are you? Um, I, I don't know how to get more of this. The nitrogen. Like, I'm not 100% sure how to get more. You're busy. I see. Yes, yes, there's another leak. Thank you. There is another leak right there. Oh, my poor escape pod. Already two holes in it. Oh, boy. So dead. Okay, no errors. This here is okay. Oh, I think that's just the, the fans. This is auto chaos. It is auto chaos. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, could somebody permit uh, Usama there, please? Thank you. All right, because you have to clean the air filters as well. Thank you, Timberwolf. You're empty. You are not. Good that you at least can change the bottles when... Yeah, and then you can see it's going. Wait! Oh, God! Oh! So... The red on a CO2 bottle means it's full. The red on an O2 bottle means it's going to be empty. It's like the opposite way around. That is so evil. That is so evil. How many artists does it take to survive in an escape pod? That is a good question. Hi, <laughs> we're in trouble. We're in doubt. Run in circles, scream and shout. I don't think that's gonna. I don't think that's gonna be helpful to me for me. Tbh. Yeah, okay, nothing coming in. Okay. I feel like somebody should have just programmed these escape pods better to not go through like asteroid fields and electromagnetic, you know, storms and whatnot. Will you be able to get more supplies? Nope. Nope, this is what you get. There are different modes. There's also a mode where it's like survive X minutes. Um, and then there's also a challenge mode. But you get nothing more. Nope, this is all you this is all you get. The one bottle fills out as the other empties out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is our CO2 to O2 recycling station. Can you dismantle things you don't need? Um, so I can't dismantle things like the tin cans, for example, or the little model like those i cannot dismantle i can only dismantle system components 
So I could go and dismantle all this, for example. Master Caution, why are you full? No. What's the problem then? What is the problem? Uh, oh, ignito magnetic activity. So why are you giving me a caution? There's a basketball hoop, yes, yes. And this, there's also an achievement. Hmm. There are CRTs instead of fat screens, yep. So, yeah, I wonder if we want to just turn the generator off. I don't know if this is going to be sensible or not. No idea if this is sensible or not. Well, considering there's already a fire, and now gravity is off. Oh gosh. Oh god, there's a fire literally in my O2 to C like CO2 to O2 converter thing. more do you need yeah because there's an electromagnetic storm okay okay good fire's gone is there a fate i don't know i don't know omri that's a good question Okay, so the problem now is eh, there is a crap ton of um oh gosh do you have a battery oh god oh god i'm inside i'm inside this is bad eh. there is a large battery but it's not on oh no oh god eh. Didn't you have a large battery? You do. This is stressful! Alright, go. Okay. And... On. Why are you not turning on? You have a battery! All the batteries got drained by the storm. Yeah, I guess so. You're so slow when you're floating around. I'm to suffocate again, yeah. You're so slow floating around, this is ridiculous. There is a, like a bajillion issues. Okay, there's a lot of CO2, yes. All right, what we wanna do is, we're gonna do bad things. This is safe. Don't worry about it. This is safe. <laughs> okay. All right, turn the buzzing off. All right, this is. Okay, <laughs> should have done that earlier. That almost helped us though. Hi, Diet. <laughs> that wasn't percussive maintenance. That was um, me letting out the O2 out of the O2 bottle. So increasing the amount of oxygen in the atmosphere in the in the thingy. Yeah, I'm not sure how you're supposed to survive the electromagnetic storm. Is it hard to restart the reactor? No, it's not hard to start the reactor. 
it's just um the reactor um takes a while to boot up basically yeah so it's not like you turn the generator on and it's good to go it just takes a while basically but yeah so there's this mode as well where you have to survive a certain amount of minutes shut everything down before the storm then i die though if i turn everything off before the storm the storm lasts so long that i that that i'll run out of stuff you die because of the co2 flow at the chamber from the bottle no 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 the bottle was o2 um the CO2 was so high because of the fire extinguisher. Because mm. the fire extinguisher is a, is a CO2 based fire extinguisher. Of course. Whoever thought that up was a total genius, of course, to do that in such a tiny area, uh, tiny, tiny enclosed space. Mm hmm. But then there's lots of stuff in this game where, it, like, you know, a literal genius fix, figured things out. It's great. <laughs> All right, let's check our components here. Okay, we got a large power transformer this time. Power connector and a fuse. Yeah, this time we got a little bit more at least. rather than pluck rather than just um an on off button all right there we go that can just go there all right we have some parts if we repair something we now can good Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. The more button is damaged, the more it will tend to fail when pressed. Whoa. Screens can shut down. The more buttons damaged, the more it will tend to be triggered for no reason or not turn on. Gosh. Okay. Not dissimilar to the pile shields without proper uh, equipment. Risk of severe irradiation. Yeah, this is fine. Good morning, Sakoon. Hello. How are you? All right, another asteroid field. Good to see you. Hello, hello. I hope you're doing well today. So you're emptying out. Jesus Christ. That literally came at the same time, and that scared the ever-loving crap out of me. I swear. Okay, you are also empty. But yeah, the asteroids just sound like rain. It's a very soothing sound. That, however, was not a soothing sound. Oh god. Oh god. My reactor is sparking! My reactor is literally on fire! <laughs> this is bad! Is that it? Okay. Well, this is terrible. Um, okay. Stop. Uh, I would reckon that a large power transformer got damaged. No? Oh my god. Also, when, when it bongs, you drop stuff. By the way, in case you were wondering. Okay. Error list. No, there is a, an error list. So, is it maybe just a data transfer cable? 
where is the data transfer cable here? That's the CRT monitor. Capacity fuse. Jesus! I don't know. What's beeping? Are you beeping? Yes. Okay, good. Hey, hey again, Fat Baptist. Is this a CO2 based extinguisher? Yes. Yes, I know. I know there's a warning. Okay, we have to, we have to turn it off. We have to turn it off. There's nothing I can do about it. Okay, no repair needed. High capacity fuse. Nope. Not that. I don't think it's this, it's not that. I doubt it's the, the monitor. Um. I doubt it's the buzzer. Um. What the? Yeah, I was wondering. I'm wondering whether I don't know. I don't see a data cable at all. But that's the only thing that I can think of. That must be broken. Hi, Ganymede. Hello. The atomic shield. No, I, I, I can't take off the atomic shield. Oh God, it's like really hot. Oh God, no, it is the atomic shield. Oh God. Wait, is it, is it the generator? No, it's not my birthday. You're super good. You won't listen to your dreams being lots of fun. Oh, that's awesome. So no, I can't do that. Whoopsie, I, I'll just, um, don't mind me. I'll just uh, quickly throw the, uh, you know, atomic generator on the floor here. I don't know what the problem is. don't know what the problem is also now buttons can also break yes buttons can also break hmm now it's not my birthday yet I have a couple more days Like, there is a data cable thingy right there. Main computer is now offline. No? Low battery. Too low power. Yeah, I know. Is that though because you were just booting up? No, you still have an error. You get really hot. Hi, Shine Bee. Yeah, that thing is getting really hot. Temperature system offline. Yeah, I know. I turned that off. Yeah, that is almost time for the manual, but... Like... Main generator. If you have never time to heat up or cool down, make sure systems are properly equipped with power transformers and fuses. First, inside the generator, stabilize the temperature to proper levels depending on system's consumption. A damaged pr processor can stop it from being properly. But I swear I chucked the processor in there. Wait, where is the processor? Wait, where is the processor? Because it's not in there. Is it? Great! That's, that was great. 
Hey, legit old school. This 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 game is mental. Yes. Um. Oh gosh. Where's the where's the fire extinguisher over here? Oh no, I'm so slow. My tin cans are literally on fire. <sighs> no, no, up, up. And Shinobi, how are you doing today? You have to use so much to extinguish this fire. It's just not turning off. Are we done now? Are we good now? Like, it's still making the noises. Are you on fire? No. Okay. Um, I assume... Okay, everything is offline. Okay. This is safe. This is safe. Totally safe. Uh-huh, it's totally safe. I don't know what you're saying, this is totally safe. Oops. I'll just be inside the system for a second. Um, dare I turn this back on now? We have a leak. This is a problem. No, actually it's not a problem. Alright. So I turned this back on. You're buzzing at me. Do you? Oh god. Right, everything is buzzing at me now. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, 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 cool. You're buzzing at me though because the CO2 is too high. Yes. And then O2 is way too high as well, apparently. <laughs> uh. So, um, you wanna do that? <laughs> this is safe. This is totally safe, yep. Pressure is way too high. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What if I, what if I do this? Eh, no, no, don't go up, go down. Wait, wait. What if I do that? This is safe, right? There we go. How's the pressure now? Oh god, I can't see. <laughs> okay. The atmosphere pressure is better. So that's good. Uh, but... It's so insane! Oh god, I hate the battery. I just hate the the, the freaking battery. Where the heck? I don't even I don't even know where the there's the repair kit. Nope. I could not find the thingy. There we go. <laughs> open it. Well, we're trying to open it. We were basically what we're trying to do is um we were trying to fix the pressure <laughs> yeah open the airlock don't forget to lock the hatch back before filling it again yeah that's kind of what we did but the problem is i think my biggest issue and i mean that's obviously also on purpose duh um my biggest issue is the light like the lack of light when the main things go offline that's the that's the hardest thing hey eek the cats Obviously on purpose, right? Um, this is all, like, the, 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 the entire way this game is designed is to make it really hard for you. <laughs> but um, it's fine, it's fine, we got this. We got this. Um, all right. We made it longer though, half a minute longer. This is the kind of stress you don't like in your games. I like it. 
I like it when like I know that's what I'm getting into like I won't I want like um I I, I don't think I could play this for like let's say like 10 hours straight but for a little bit like three to four hours it's like really fun yes yes indeed neo uni indeed is there an end other than death uh, not in this mode um there is the rescue mode where you only have to survive a certain amount of time uh you have to keep in that mode you have to keep your rescue beacon online for a certain amount of time and then you get rescued but uh, not in this mode in this mode there is no escape you just die <laughs> in this mode you just die But yeah, apparently there's a um, there's a, a lot more deaths. I mean, there's still like we haven't okay asteroid field. We haven't yet died to being really cold or being really hot. All right, I wanted to check what we have this time. We have a pump. Meow. We have. Two large batteries and a fuse. Wow, oh, I know cat. Nothing in there. Okay, alright. I feel good about this. Hey Robes, good to see you. Uh, I'm gonna take one of the batteries. And uh, put it in there because because you need repair parts like there's nothing around it like you just need repair parts so wow yeah somebody's being a silly but aren't you cats no no you can't no you can't I tried but you cannot like it doesn't like you can throw them in there and then close the door but you can't like they don't count they're just flavor. Yeah, I know. It's really mean. Uh oh. Okay. Band monitor. Yeah. 40! To repair it? No, 49 to repair the mo Yeah, okay, no, we're gonna just deal with a bat monitor now. That's just that's just how it is. We'll just have to deal with a bat monitor. Jesus, that's so many Oh boy, what's your problem now? You have enough place to spin your actual job? Fair enough. I know this is not as I said, like I probably would not be able to play this. Bad processor. I would not be able to play this for like a... Where even... Wait, where even is that? Hey, Mr. Bacon! Oh god. We gotta focus on the gravity generator. But we have gravity right now. Like, that's not the problem. Um Okay, wait, one second. Um It doesn't actually tell you. Um cause, cause I only see the power connector. There up, up there is the stupid data connector, are you kidding me? That's where the bloody data connector is. There's the processor, okay. Oh my god. It's a hidden like up there. No wonder I didn't see it. Oh. <laughs> uh, so we decided to scrap buttons and beepers and have some repair stock. Yeah. I mean that's what I'm doing basically. Goodness me. There we go. Might as well fix the air filters while we're waiting for this to be done. Hmm. 
That is so hidden. That is so freaking hidden. Okay, so you're... Now firing out. Gotcha. Uh, how long have till FG scraps all but one CRT? Well, that's gonna happen sooner or later. Eventually that'll happen. I, I kind of though wish... Um, and this is something that the devs might want to still change. Um, if you have items in your hand, there's still motion blur on the items. And that makes it really hard for me to look at the items and concentrate on them. I wish... If you turn off motion blur, it would also turn it off for the per object motion blur. Um, because I, I can't focus on those things uh, without... Um, like I, I, can't fo I just can't focus on them, period. Do we have infinite spare parts? No, Grunark, that would be too easy. No, we do not. We got a couple of items in these here drawers. We have uh, one more battery, I think, to spare. But we have one more spare battery. And one spare fuse. And those are all our spare parts. Those are all our spare parts. And that's it. So, yeah. Hey, Courageous Phoenix. Yeah. Part of you wants to see how long a run with a fully stock part lasts. Days, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Alright, Ice Nebula detected. Atomic pile output limited. Oof. So yeah, it's basically a how long can you survive a really bad situation type deal. So there are, this is, this is infinite mode. There are also timed modes where you only have to survive a certain amount of time until you get rescued. Uh, and that's like 6 minutes, 10 minutes, 15, 20, 25, and 30, I think. Something like that. 30 is the long, 30 minutes is the longest. I've only made it... 12 minutes but that's in this if you play rescue mode though you have one minute to go and grab items from the station you end up with a high score well yeah not not a high score you just end up with a time yeah you end up with a with a time basically so i guess our power output is now gonna go down meow uh, where could we see the power output again here, right? Right there. Yes, you are the saddest cat around. You only had treats today twice already and lots of food and pets and scritches. And there's the power. Oh my goodness. All right. That's a limited power. Hi, Toothless Shark. Hello, hello. How are you today? Okay. And you have to clean the air filters as well. Pet the kitty. Yes. Uh, will do. Give me a moment. So we might try... We might try that... The rescue mode again. Now that we know a little bit more how to play that game. Yeah, the cat The cat is like super neglected. Yes. Indeed. Right, kitty cat? <laughs> the saddest of cats. Yes. Yes, indeed. <gasps> Give the kitty a treat. <gasps> Treats! Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, he's so excited. He was like vibrating with wanting that treat. <coughs> Meow, indeed. <coughs> I wonder how long it takes to get through this. Temp is fine. Temperature there is fine. C 
the O2 and O2 is all fine. Could turn off the repair station. Don't need that on right now. Uh, I don't know if that means we can turn the normal... Oh no, the normal lights are theoretically on. Hey Blaine, thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. While I sleep. While I, while, while I stream, you mean, but yes. Hey Frostrum, hello, hello. Yeah, cat, chat decided at the start of the stream today that it would be a great idea to have a level 5 freaking hype train. So, uh, enjoy that sub. <laughs> enjoy the, su uh, the, the sub. This is still pretty full though. Isn't it? This is all good. I, I, I feel this is weird. The nitrogen presented percentage is really low. Oh, okay, turn off the dark carbon dioxide scrubber. It's, uh... You get the lights back. Are they actually working, though? Yeah, they are. You can actually see that they are working. Okay. I don't think you're super allergic to grasses. They're high and don't feel like death. That's nice. That's good. Grasses here yesterday were yucky. God, this ice nebula. Takes forever. Does my cat have a Scottish accent? No, my cat is Greek, German, English, I guess. <laughs> oh, I'll turn that off, but that's the cooling. But then... Oh. Now the gravity generator is off. But I didn't turn off the gravity generator. Oh, is this the gravity generator? Wait. No, that's the main computer. What did I just turn off? Because I hit this button. Why did the gravity generator turn off? I guess it's just broken? Okay. Oh, okay. Now now suddenly it's fine again. That was weird. Okay. There you go. Somehow some of the buttons don't like the monitors don't have things right now but i think that's because we're still not yeah we're slowly increasing our power output again are we upside down no no the main generator is always up there <laughs> are you going to start as a vr game no this game is not available in vr yet it will be available in vr eventually Yes, the gravity monitor, uh, the gravity generator is at the bottom. Correct. Oh, oh, low battery. Yeah, that's fine. Low battery, that's fine too. Um. That's not a problem. Yeah, every time because it like it has the per option motion blur, I get confused and think that something is wrong because it's like as an effect that we're like not feeling well, you know. But it's that's not it. Okay, this is all good. The pressure is good. Theoretically, turn the repair station back on. 
Because she throwing gas containers on the floor. They're empty. It's fine. They're fine. It's empty. Hey, Towser Wolves. Hello. But yeah, no, it's it's um so far VR doesn't exist yet. But they're working on it. They're working on it. All right, 14 minutes. Yeah, we got, we got, we got. We had it easy. We had it easy. Uh, Ice Nebula is easy. You just have reduced power output. Yes, what is it, kitty cat? Mm. I can't see kitty cat. I need to look at my... There we go. Uh, the filters. Cat wants more power output. <laughs> But we're at maximum. We're at maximum power output now. Ooh, asteroid field detected. Yeah, now it gets funky. Yeah, this is maximum power output that we can do. Hey, Kazir. Well, the cat was mostly running around. I'm waiting for him to go back on the windowsill so I can turn cat cam on again. Yeah, that monitor is broken. Don't pay attention to it. It's fine. It's fine. Nothing to worry about. I think. <clears throat> oh, there they come. That's the asteroid field. Oh, yeah. Uh -oh. Um, alright. What's the problem? What's the problem? Error list. I assume that means bat. Oh, God. Bat data connector. Um, garage generator was considered ground support. Yes. Oh God. Okay. So the thing is with this game, you literally can't. Um. You literally can't keep stuff. Uh, one hundred percent repaired. Like you'll have to start. Ow, at some point. I'm just checking if there's a leak somewhere. You have to start dismantling systems. No, that was just a sound command. Um, Cause you, you, you don't, you never will have enough spare parts to repair stuff, ever. Oh, there is a leak, there is, ah. I looked everywhere except on the... Ow! Except on the frickin' floor. Um... But what I'm gonna do is dismantle these things. So we have a little bit extra stuff. But I think the generator. Oh god. The gravity generator is probably gonna start going soon, TM. Uh, low battery bat monitor. Yep, that's, that's just how it's gonna be. That's just how it's gonna be. It's just gonna be bat monitor. For now. Got it. Survive. Oh. Wait. That was... It got knocked loose, I guess. Wait, there's a hole. Hole, 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 hole. Yeah. Go away. Go away, hole. Go sit in the corner and think about what you've done. I know, right? Also, cat. And then cat's back. Right, how is this? okay it's okay all right i think we got we got we got lucky so what i okay can confirm what i hate the most elect electromagnetic storms hate the most electromagnetic storms suck butts 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They suck. <laughs> Absolutely and utterly suck. Because they just cause fire and then the generator goes offline and then everything is just bad. Sorry. Whoever is driving this thing, can you please just not make us go through them? Hey, pew, 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 pata. 20 minutes. I know, right? High score. Very nice. Very freaking nice. I, I, oh. Oh, that was just in the music, I think. Yeah. Um, I think what I want to do is after this try rescue mode again and work on rescue mode stuff uh because there's an achievement to be had if you do all the rescue mode stuff and um we have uh words we have words no um we have 30 minutes is the longest in that and we've we, we're kind of getting there we're kind of getting close so there, i'm gonna switch these out I'm gonna switch these out. Those are already done. Oh, uh, the giveaway is now closed, actually. I need to draw the winner. Hi, Combat. Hello. We will draw the winner in just a moment. Gravitational singularity. Pressure rising. Okay. Okay, that's... I've never had that before. Um... Sorry. What do I do? Do I just open the door? I guess I just opened the door, eh? That's fine. Ooh, hi, Progen. Hello. Yeah, congratulations. And thanks again to the devs for the key. Because they gave me the key. So, to, to do the giveaway. So, that's cool. Alright, so you're sinking. Yeah, okay, good. Gonna pop like a balloon. Not really, because the pressure's going down. No, no, no. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God, it makes everything open! No! <laughs> what the frick? Oh, God! <laughs> it's stupid grabs, and it's, like, pulling me around as well. Oh, no. Oh, I hate this. This is the worst. Oh god, this is terrible! <laughs> okay, okay. I'm gonna unlock this real quick. Okay. How we're looking now. Oh my god. Whoa! This is so violent now! Okay, I'm just, I'm just live over here now. <laughs> Oh, F's in chat. Yeah, honestly. <laughs> right. Oh, God. There are... Ba there are... What's the, what's the issue? What? Okay. Low battery. Okay. Low battery. That's fine. Low battery bat monitor. Okay, we're, we're back to one bar. Is it like doing a, a distortion effect as well? It almost feels like it's doing a di distortion effect on my on my visual field as well. It's because it's when a delivery mail fruit involves the delivery person running away. You've got second group once you're on when you cross the coffee door was thrown at you. That sounds uh uh, really bad. How do you know a person's Discord when you just know their Twitch name? You don't. Um, you don't. Unless they are Discord partner. Why? Most people have their Discord link though. Uh, on their, uh, on their page. That's a lot of O2. I'm gonna go stop that for a second. What happens if the pressure goes too high? You're dead. 
you are dead if the pressure gets too high. Also, Park, hello, how are you? Yeah, I'm definitely gonna take a look at that at that delivery in a bit because the, the package is also really smushed. Um, okay. Temperature is fine. The breathability is crap, though. Why is it? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's fine. Stop. I swear, I'll just disconnect the buzzer. <laughs> Why do they keep opening? Because there is a gravitational anomaly that we're flying through, or that we were flying past. And um, the gravitational anomaly uh, was pulling everything. <laughs> okay, what's going on? Why were you yelling at? By uh, when it was twenty-one. Yeah, should they be locked? Well, it's not probably not have been it probably hasn't been maintained very well in this escape pod to be fair Because that's kind of what they do in this escape pod I wonder if you can if you if you Can theoretically Oh, okay, I think I get it now how you make nitrogen right because you have nitrogen here I don't know I don't know it's weird I don't I don't quite understand if you ever can run out of nitrogen or if that's not the case there we go just wanted to clean that filter okay, that O2 bottle is full that one's almost empty all right, cool, 27 minutes. But then we've not hit a freaking uh, electromagnetic storm yet. And that's why. That's why we're doing all right. Asteroid field detected, great. So, oh, if I turn this off, will the batteries start charging? If we have excess power, I assume the batteries will stop charging, right? Oh. That's another thing to manage. Though it doesn't actually seem to be making a difference. Where is the battery? I thought you had it was all you got from the guy before you drove off. Why did you not pursue legal action? Because that sounds like something you very much want to pursue legal action with, McRar. Ow! My poor brain, ow! Ow! Yeah, that, that sounds very dangerous. Uh-oh, there are more errors. So that means that the data thingy is bad. But where the heck? There's the data connector. Right, we're going to turn that off. Pop that in there, turn it on. Repair it. Change the red light mode. We could. Ow. Here. Nice how it does a little nice ding sound for us. One more minute for half an hour. Yep. Low battery back monitor. Yeah, 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 I know. Okay. I 
would have still very much pursued that, I think. Because that is... Second degree burns, there's nothing to joke about. A component microwave, yeah, pretty much. Ow! My brain! No battery, low motor, low pump. Uh-huh. Um, think I probably won't be able to afford to repair this. Yeah. Shoot some hoops. I don't think that that's going to help me. But hey, maybe. Is this the headache sh shuttle? It is the headache shuttle. Yes. Very much so. Very much so. Go faster! Hi Tom! Have I turned off motion blur? Yes. Um, there is still per object motion blur though. Hi everyone, a dragon. Hello. Why am I in a tin can? Is the only escape pod that was close to where I uh, was. Yeah, that's why. The only escape pod available. Hey, Asian gamer. Low pump, bad filter. Damn bad. Are you sure is it just a terrible data connector? No, it's not. That's crazy. Okay, let's let's deal with this real quick. There we go. God, the monitor being broken is really annoying. So yeah, there is there is no motion blur per se, like in this, but then you have per option, per, per object motion blur for some reason. Hmm. And you can't turn that off, unfortunately. Um, it's not too bad. Actually, like, I, I can deal with this. It's not ideal. I'd love for it to not have it. Damn. Oh, damaged battery. Is that what it is? Yeah, see, like, everything else is fine, but the battery, for some reason, is still... Hello. Doing that. Ah. <sighs> Panic flipping through the manual. Well, it's more of a... Um... I am having error codes right now that I don't know what to do with. That's the problem. Low pump, bat monitor. What does low pump mean? I don't know what low pump means. 19, uh, 29. Low pump. The pump is not working properly, not enough power, damage pump, empty bottle, dirty air filter. Uh. That's not empty though. But... Oops. I ripped. Dink to dink. Yeah, it says no repair needed. So... Yeah, so there's there's low battery. There's low battery. The mon the monitor is bad, and then there's low pump. As well, there's three error messages with that system. Yeah, and there's low pump, not enough power, damaged pump, empty bottle, dirty air filter. I cleaned the air filter though. Unless the air filter is broken. Still says low pump. 
Uh, the air filter is broken. Well, crap. Chat. Whoopsie. We might have to say bye bye to our lights. Yeah. We're gonna go say bye bye to our lights. <laughs> the damage report machine is broken. That too, yes. That too. I can juggle the filters. I could also juggle the filters, true. I could juggle the filters. Well, frick. I hear a fire, I think. But I don't see it unless it's up there. No, there's no fire there. Okay, maybe not. Uh, yeah, yeah, clearly, clearly it decided we didn't need this. Exactly. I mean, we don't need it. This is fine. Totally fine. Nothing to worry about. The problem is we have like no batteries loaded at all. Can the gravity thing burn? Yeah, everything could burn. So we have no battery, like nothing is on battery power. Like, oh, we're so dead. Every time there's a spark going up, you look at your computer. Oh no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nope, I need to turn that the flashlight off yeah but not for very much longer okay what we're gonna do is we're gonna do an emergency no oh, stop oh god eh no stop it okay <laughs> that was just an emergency uh, oxygen distributing mechanism we were still clearly running out of stuff. Okay. Are we done? <laughs> oh, now I'm getting cold. Yeah, it makes sense. Well, I have to turn it back on now. Like, I have to. Um. Yeah, thanks. I I know it's cold. Can I take you off to to make the temperature go up? <laughs> That's fine, right? Take off the the shielding. Cuz yeah, the problem is, like, I turned the power back on, but I guess it's not turning anything else on. So, whoopsie, what I'm wondering is, oh, we just have a little bit too much power drawing power. Oh, God. Eh, eh. Um, oh god, I'm like inside of the thing. Is it just not making enough power just yet? Okay, that's off. That's off. Oh, this is, this is bad. I think everything is off though, that's the problem. Right? Where's the hand coil? There it is. No, no, get back here! Get back here! Oh. I mean... The CO2 again. Yeah, but I, I honestly don't know. Hi, Cormacker. Hello. Exchange the main battery. 
There, there is no battery in the generator. Yeah, I don't know why the generator itself wasn't turning on. Unless it got damaged. But I don't think it was damaged. How are you doing today, Cormacker? Huh. No, I, uh... I, um... Turned into repair parts. It died due to the electromagnetic storm. I don't think it can though. Because that is just... That would be no fun to have like a condition that just completely can end your run like that. Because there's nothing you can do about it. Because I can't repair that. Hi VHEX! Hello! It was minus 9 degrees. But we didn't die because of that. We died because of the temperature. <laughs> uh, we died because of the uh, CO2. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Yeah, we've survived 93 minutes. We are now... Well, it still says bronze, but I, I got silver. So am I, like, on the leaderboard now? 93 minutes is, like, 1 hour 33, right? No. So that must be... So there's... You have the total number. Or... Wait. Or the achievement is broken. Oh, that's supposed to... Oh. Silver survived one accumulated hour in ranking. Okay. Alright. So that's different. The so repair was not working anymore. Yeah, but I don't think I can fix that. And there's two, five. Experience every death. Five. Yeah, the nebulars. Five stars. Okay. Cool. I don't know why this particular menu gets so loud it's so strange <laughs> it gets so loud um but hey i mean 40 minutes we pretty much like tripled our time but yeah i don't know i don't know um um Uh, I don't know how to deal with electromagnetic storms. Everything else, we kind of know how to deal with. But electromagnetic storms, we kind of don't. Or at least I don't. Um, yeah, I, I don't know how to deal with those just yet. Like, because even if you turn stuff off and it run it off batteries stuff still gets broken and like like shorts out but maybe maybe the generator's fuse was just broken but then we had no power in our batteries to run everything else because uh turning the systems off that we turned off did not charge the batteries enough Yeah, maybe. But if you switch everything off, then you kind of just die. Uh, because... Cat, no. Don't you dare try to drink my tea again. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. 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 So no. I'm gonna try to do this one now though. What are you doing, Kat? You're just being a silly butt today. Um Cause this is a little bit more chill, actually. The rescue mode. Cause what you can do in rescue mode is you can grab items yourself. You grab items yourself. And now I know lots of batteries is good. <laughs> I will try 10 minutes. I think rescue mode is theoretically like what is just like designed to teach you how to survive a bit better. But I mean, what's the fun in that, you know? What's the fun in that? 
Wow, we'll have so much stuff. This is gonna be great. <laughs> this is kind of baby mode now. Well, that's okay. That's okay. That is okay. Love the freebies. Same. Yes, it's great. It's great. Because, yeah, now, now in this mode, you have this. And now it's 10 minutes till you get rescued. And this can also fail and break and you have to maintain it as well. So this is another sy system in this mode that can break, which can't break in the other mode. But you still don't have um, every system available in this mode. Um, yeah. Because like the main computer system, for example, is completely dead and gone. Uh, hi, Rick. Need to go to work. Sakoon, have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate it. Have a good one. Thanks so much for hanging out. I will see you uh, tomorrow. Didn't I take? I took a buzzer. Just a, whoa! Holy crap! There's so much stuff in there. This is definitely easy mode now. Do you don't have any parts? No, you do definitely have parts. Uh, you actually have more parts in this mode than in the other mode. Where the heck do the buzzers go? I don't remember where the buzzers go. Is it electronics? It is electronics. There we go. You actually, yeah, you just get more stuff in this mode. Um, this is designed to teach you how to then play the ranked mode later on. How can it auto survive in space? It's outer space. Easy. Exactly what Cucumber said. <laughs> I don't know where this goes though. I'm just currently like putting stuff away. Don't mind me. Uh, I guess credit for you winning the Apex game. How so? I didn't do anything. Oh, we're, we're like full on pumps. Got it. Okay. What are you doing, cat? No. Don't you dare try to drink my tea. No, bad cat. <laughs> All right. Everything's nominal. Everything's nominal. Me Indeed. Me Cheers. Me SLB and Selkin, thanks for the hydrates. Oh, I see, I see. I see, I see. Hey, Loki. Hello. How are you doing today? Yeah, no, the kitty cat does not get tea, though. Because it's unhealthy. And dangerous for the cat, so the cat doesn't get it. Nope. Uh, you do at least. My tea is actually, well, I mean, there's like a, there's like the little tiny little bit left in the, in the, in the cup. So I'm good. Right, we'll just wait now, I guess. Are we go? Oh, yeah, I don't have a freaking mo- like, I don't have this, so I don't know. What's going on? Uh, I assume it's the icy nebula. It's icy nebula right now. Yes, little Zalaria, we have drawn the winner already. Sorry, but um, Bin Bin won. Milk is bad too. Yes, milk is bad too. Uh, do you need a battery? Oops. I can give you a battery. You broke down and bought Lost Nova. Lost Nova is great. It's very chill. I hope you enjoy it, uh, Giggles. What's that? 
Where does this go? Oh, it goes here. Okay. I need buttons though. You must get sugar, kitty should get milk. No, because they'll poop everywhere, Loki. Because most cats are lactose intolerant, so you give them diarrhea and gastric distress if you give them milk. So uh, don't, I recommend. Do not do that. You don't need this, do you? Does that go that way around? I feel like it goes the other way around. No, apparently for this one it goes this way around. Uh, we do need an on and off button though. Um, I never turned you on. Welp. Hey! Booting part OS. Please wait. I feel like we're missing something. Uh, have a good one, Zolaria. Thank you so much for hanging out. Sleep well. Sleep well. Have a wonderful, wonderful night's rest. Uh, humans are the only one that keeps lactose digestion into adulthood. From what you understand. Yes, indeed, it started with the Europeans. It started with, um, basically, it started with the people that Oh god. Um, stuff is bad. Right. Are we good now? Are we good? Were you yelling at me? Okay, there is still an error message. 2NOA. Okay. Uh, it started with a lot of the people that um, basically started animal husbandry. 2NOA. 226. That's just low battery. I received by the system is too low. The system is at least partially on battery. Yep. Mm hmm. You found that when you went vegan, you lost your lactose tolerance. Mmm. I see. Okay, this is all good. The temperature is low, though. But that's okay. Okay, main computer. So there's still some stuff that we're missing. What do we miss? What are we missing, though? Not batteries. Do you need, like, do you need a giant fuse? Do you have a fuse? I don't remember what, what, nope, oh, it does need a fuse. What the? It doesn't want to go uh, in there though, for some reason. Yep, it's just like, nope. Hey, Mike Fatbird, hello, how are you? being weird because it should go in there but it's not I feel like that's broken Maybe I need to remove the power connector first. Yeah, maybe. No, it just doesn't want to go in for some reason. That one works. I wonder if that's broken. Ghost hand, try from the other side. Ah. Smart. Uh, no, it's just telling you, it's just showing you where you can grab onto. Uh, you can hold onto these things with your hands and this means you have grabbed it with your left hand and that means you grabbed it with your right hand still not booting though uh, let's see how we'll look in here though yeah probably a data cable I would assume so as well okay 
those sorted. O2 is foul. Can you hear me? It's me. I'm aboard the rescue ship. We're almost there. Just keep your beacon online a few more seconds so we don't lose you. We're going to bring you home, all right? Yeah, sounds good. Am I not hearing or am I hallucinating a leak? I guess I was hallucinating a leak. Is this a VR game? No be Well, not currently be But... Hi Voidheim! Uh, it will be coming out in VR. Hey Hildebrand! Hello, hello! I got rescued! Yay! Yeah, it's coming out in VR, but it's not available in VR yet. Yeah, so you do 15 minutes, 20, 25, and then 30. And then you can also, there are also challenges. One button to rule them all. Fireworks. Will it ever end? No touching. Opened window? No. You can't do it with 3D movement in VR, though. I probably also wouldn't be able to. Mm -hmm. We survived. We did it, yeah. To be fair... To be fair, um, like 15 minutes is like easy mode. <laughs> Hi.